When my son and I moved in here, it wasn't as warm as we hoped. I'm gonna light a vanilla candle, and it's gonna be a game changer. Will it go? And after midnight, the house comes alive. This place is haunted! All right, that's a clip from the new Disney movie Haunted Mansion, which opens this Friday. And we thought it would be fun to take a look at some locations here in the Vegas Valley that might also be haunted. Joining us now is Tandy Hornsby, who's an expert with Vegas Ghost Tour. Thanks so much for joining Thank us. Thank you for having me. Okay, so this movie is based on the very popular Haunted Mansion ride at Disneyland, which mm -hmm. is so much fun, mm -hmm. and it does give you a scare. Why do you think people like being spooked out? You know, it's funny because here in Las Vegas, we get tours from all over the world, mm -hmm. really. And there's nothing that brings people together more than a little ghost story. <laughs> it's I, true. Th yeah, it is. It's, um, and the, you know, everybody has their own traditions and whatnot. And it's kind of like you get to see a version of history that maybe not everybody knows. Okay. So um, they're usually pretty historic and sometimes surprisingly accurate okay so there are some places here in town that may be haunted so we're talking about three today very mm -hmm. popular tourist destinations mm -hmm. so first let's uh, start with the Bugsy Siegel Memorial is there really ghost activity there yes yes he's um, he's very very active there are different kinds of hauntings some are the they just repeat the same thing over and over with no real knowledge that they're a ghost or that you're not but Bugsy is an intelligent haunting he knows that he's a ghost he knows you're not and he kind of likes to play around with people um, okay yeah one thing you can like you if you smell the strong odor of cigars uh huh. Even if he's not being visually appearing, that cigar, that is his trademark. He loved his Cuban cigars. Really? His plaid suits. How do you fedoras. know it's not just someone walking down the hallway smoking a cigar? That's what's funny because I've had guests on my tour and they said, you know, you just don't see that much smoking inside the casino anymore. You're not really supposed mm -hmm. to do it. And a couple of girls said that they were staying near the most haunted presidential room and they said they came out of their room and they saw an ashtray with a cigar on it on one side. They said it's just weird because you don't see ashtrays. Yeah. I'm like, that is kind of weird. I hadn't told them this story yet. Uh -huh. And they said when they came back, it was on the other side of the doorway. Huh. I'm like, should I tell them? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to scare them too much. <laughs> did you tell them? I did. Yes. And, yes. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, so you're part of Vegas Ghost Tour. Um, so you guys are kind of tracking ghost activity throughout the valley, right? We what do are. you guys do? We are. It's um, We give a tour on the strip where it's complete immersion, total immersion, mm -hmm. and we tell ghost stories along the way um, and it's just fantastic and we have another trip um, tour downtown that's a speakeasy mm -hmm. and you just can't get away from the ghost tours wow. <laughs> the stories, no matter where you are there's going to be a ghost story well I bet here and and one that took me by surprise is the Bellagio yes. is haunted yes a lot of these things I have to do research I'm like really wait a minute <laughs> So what part of the Bellagio? Well, underneath the Bellagio, hidden is a deep little cavern where a lot of the maintenance people and wrench fixers, um, they, they li pretty much stay down there uh -huh. to do their work. And most of the work happens um, after 1230 because midnight is the last fountain show. So these people come out after that. And the stories that they tell um, are, are just breathtaking. Wow. They're people who've gotten stuck in the machinery and then when they were finally recovered, having drowned, they had what looked like bites all oh. over their body. And there's no, there are no, there's no wildlife in the fountains. Right. So people wow. are kind of, they, nobody could explain these little bites. So interesting. Okay, you know what? We're gonna have to have you back around Christmas time because this <laughs> is our Christmas in July show. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's the information on your screen. Just go to VegasGhosts.com to take one of those tours on the Strip and downtown, right? And it's and if you look it up, it's U.S. Ghosts, and the oh, okay. U.S. is important because that's like us, U.S. Right. Ghosts. Okay. Well, thank you so much. Really right. appreciate it. Thank you. All right, spooky. <laughs>